Welcome ladies and gentlemen to this new tutorial today. We are talking about web security and uh, at first everything you learn here is for securing your own web application and not to hack anybody else's. So I'm not liable for any special direct or indirect damage or for any other damage resulting from the use of the information presented in this video. All right. So after knowing this, uh, we're learning about uh, injections. So I have uh, prepared a citation from Wikipedia and an injection is used by an attacker and hacker to introduce or inject code into vulnerable computer program and change the course of execution. So uh, what does this mean? Uh, we need to uh, uh, have an input field, a text field, a formula to post our code to the server, uh, which saves our code inside of a database. And then uh, this uh, code has to be shown on the web page for any visitor so that this code can uh, get executed on the web page. So we save something in the database. This uh, string, this code is uh, presented on the web page and executes on the web page and uh, changes our uh, way how our web application works. So I have prepared a web page. Uh, it's a restaurant, a pizza restaurant and the website is uh, visible at www.rudolfsonspizzaesy.es and uh, of course you can try to hack this page because it's uh, created for educational purposes so uh, please start I can reset the web page every now and then so that it's usable for others who want to learn a bit about uh, securing their web applications. So um, I'm working on my local host because I want to change uh, uh, the code in the backend so that uh, I can show you how to do it in the right way so that the page is not hackable anymore. So. Uh, okay, this is a page, uh, pizza restaurant. We have the opening hours. We can order pizza. We have a little description here. And if we click on order or we click here above on order, uh, we get a menu, uh, with some pizzas. Uh, we can choose between vegetarian pizza and meat pizza. So, um, uh, this is a formula which gets posted on the uh, web server, I guess. So I created it, of course it does, but uh, if you're working and uh, on your uh, securing your web applications, uh, you have to think like a hacker. So this is an input field and uh, here we can post something on the server. We can inspect this here because we see, okay, this is a formula, it's action. There's something we could inject probably. So uh, then uh, we have a guest book which is pretty cool because uh, we can enter something here like Lucas Lucas post this instantly and okay I've posted Lucas Lucas often so maybe I type in Katie and post this and as you see the name gets posted uh, and the message gets posted it saves something inside of the database and displays this data on the database. So this is something where we can inject uh, something to uh, hack this page. So if we uh, look at this, uh, we see that we have a form here and an action on something and it's a post method. So we can inject something here probably. Then we have a login page and uh, of course, this is a formula which posts something on the web server. So this is probably injectable. So if we knew the uh, username and password, we can log in. We will uh, uh, we will learn how to hack this page, how to get the usernames and passwords. If your web application is not secure enough, 
and uh, we can log in and then we can create a new pizza here and we have a secret chat where all the employees and the admin and the boss uh, could write something and here's the difference between the uh, guest book that we can write a text here give feedback and if we post this it takes the name uh, with which we logged in so probably we can change this name to somebody else's so that we can write in somebody else's name so this would be evil so maybe we can do this so that's something uh, we will learn in the next video so that's the first video <clears throat> and in the next video we will learn about html injection in the second video we will learn about javascript injections and in the, in the last tutorial series videos of this uh, tutorial series we will learn about uh, sql injections so uh, please uh, give me thumbs up if you like this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button share this video and try to hack the uh, rudolfsonspizza.esy.es and we see us in the next video bye